This is as far as we're going. They're out. The drugstore. Yeah, he's a friendly non-zombie guy that happens to be eating people. Yeah. Just let him be eaten. Right. He, look, he reminds me of Sid from Microsoft. A little bit, yeah. Yeah, like other people have made that connection before I've noticed. So now we're in the drugstore. We can't take risks. Yay, drugs! Woo! And we can't just let people die either. Drugs are great, kids. Stay shut no matter what. I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Say it right in front of me. Right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? We have kids. They would have died out there. We have kids with us. I see one little girl. What is it? I, I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. In a minute. In a minute, Cleo. That's a good choice. Because if he's like, just go, she's like, well, he doesn't give a shit. And then your relationship is strained in the early stages. I didn't hear what you said because you're talking. What about her? She's not wrong. She looks like something that you need someone that you need to agree with. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. And we appreciate it. Now let's settle down. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He was oh, he wasn't bitten. Was he? Hell he wasn't. We have to end this now. Yeah, shoot him. Our dead body. We'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no fight. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. Reason with him? Lily, I'll him. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody's doing anything. Shut up, Lily. Yeah. And you, shut the fuck up. So this is this is the main theme of The Walking Dead is not oh shit there's zombies it's oh shit I'm trapped in a room full of complete assholes. Who are being... fuck way too much that's coming from me. Yeah. Then again in like a zombie apocalypse that's really when you just don't bother to turn. What if it was your girl? Dad, get it. It's a big deal. What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. You would. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. He's married. Don't say what. Oh my God. Yeah. What? There's someone in there. It's just, just I don't locked. know. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, don't I'm let her go. What, what is wrong with these people? He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she'll she does, she'll do very good Nope. The first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, when she's dead, this he'll is just probably pounce on your little girl. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man eater. He's a man eater. Make it work. And we're tossing him out now. <laughs> Stop him, because. Uh, uh, neutral... Which one? No. You didn't even try. I said no. Oh, shoot. Not a goddamn scratch. What do you think about that? It's Larry. And I'm fucking sorry. Good. Look, we're fish in a barrel here. With all the commotion, we could be under siege any minute. We better start By the kid who's trying to get into the bathroom with someone in there. Good. Dad, sit down. I'm fine, Lily. The dead Dad, need to please. pee, too? 
Call it! Clem! We gotta save her! Of course. Of fucking course. Uh, what? Is no one gonna uh, fucking uh, help him? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. There we go. I love how no one helped him. Except for, you know, her. Because oh, she shot him in the head. Okay. But everyone else just didn't. Like, She's the only one with a gun. Pick up shit. Oh, guys. Just give him a shot. Oh, duck. What a shame. It's okay, he's him? not dead. What's wrong with it? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. Um, through the office. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. Mm. That doesn't matter. Because this is his parents' drugstore. Ooh! Yeah. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you think? I don't know what that is. We need as much gas it's a fort. So we can <sighs> downtown make it fast. Agreed. I'll get gas. You need you need to brush up on your history, man. Yeah. Take a fucking towards visual arts degree. So? I didn't even hear what he said. That'd be great. <laughs> yeah, that'd be great. Well, it's got to get done. Plus, I'm quick, and I know make it. Local, born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie. I think he's one of the only characters who's been in the comic, the game, and the TV show. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you, what's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on Lily and Larry. Original. Work on getting you your medicine. <clears throat> That's right. And you, you keep an eye on Well, I guess she could have been named Larry yet. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot. And I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Alright. Gotta explore the store. Anything in the food box? Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this no. all went down. Uh what's that? Energy bar. Awesome. And another energy bar. Another energy bar. I think that might be all of them, though. I think he's just like taking shit. Anything happened to it's it's his parents' store. Mm. Instead of like just going straight to try and getting into the place, it's just like no, nah, I want fucking food first. Is that his well, parents? Yeah. We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. We can totally read all that shit. Yep. Okay, who do we want to talk to first? Doug, Carly, I'll talk to her. Clem. Okay, we'll talk to Carly. You're a pretty good chap. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. <laughs> mm, what are you working on? What are you messing around with there? A radio. 
I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. Right. <laughs> Should I turn it on? <laughs> yep. Power. Nothing. No, that didn't work. What about the back? No yeah. What now? You know that there are no batteries in this. Fucking tech whiz, Carly. I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. It's the fucking batteries. Yeah, it's not. It's not that difficult, I'm Carly. Watch our reporter. Looks like nobody got a chance no, okay. to play anything before this all went down. All right. Let's talk to Clementine. Can I uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. Maybe we should give her one of those energy bars we found. Maybe we should. Yeah. Just get to know each other. Yeah. So, um. Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm fine. I just, uh. I'm good. That's good. Yeah, I think so. Being good is good, despite the circumstances. It's like someone from fucking Sesame Street. Mm -hmm. Being good is good. Anywhere from one, so Anywhere from one. Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. We'll sit tight. Okay. Alright. Have an energy bar, sweetie. Thank you. Of course. Taking care of Clementine. Let's go talk to these guys. How's it doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. We already know that. There's a lot of reiteration, really. How is Hart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything? I mean, like, and Herschel fucking called Clementine your daughter like three times after we so corrected him every single one, so... None of that. You're from what? You're from here? Yeah. yeah, why not? You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force Base. Yeah, no one. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I yeah. work up at UTA. What do you think about all this? I don't know. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, I see. Uh, okay. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. Yeah. <laughs> that oh. sucks. Gee, what do you think about all this? What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more, more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. You didn't know what's wrong with him, though. Fine. What? What's wrong with him? Wrong with him? <laughs> He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep mm. him relaxed. Ah, oh, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Scott, Scott, Scott. <laughs> fuck you. Uh, I didn't hear what she said. Yeah, he doesn't mean it. He's just a little cranky. We've got kids here. Yeah. You gotta keep it PG, man. He and I are a family. I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. It seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. Where's her mom? Looks like it's hereditary. Just Somehow, a little. I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. 
I found in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answer message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Yeah, there was blood all over the place. So lucky to have you. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Do we want to give them an energy bar too? Probably, probably should. Yeah. It's not much, but here. You sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. That's, uh, really sweet. Don't mention it. We're gonna have creepy zombie sex. What? <laughs> How can I with those things out there? Ooh, the ice cream menus. Oh. Sad. That's the most. That's truly the most depressing thing about the zombie the apocalypse. The true tragedy of this game. Yeah. <laughs> no amount of death will cover up the ice cream. Stop that, Kenny. We were all frightened. Even I thought that maybe, maybe we were going to lose our boy. I'm sorry, Katja. What if he? It's okay, Lee. From here on out, Lee, I need to know that you're on my side. I am. Yeah, I no. <laughs> Good. Thank you. How's Doc doing? Doc he reluctantly doing. asks. It was just a shock. We're lucky yeah. as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. Okay. How's she doing? Yeah. Doc lives another day. She's good, I think. She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What are you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. What's the plan? What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so yeah. we ought to wait for things to clear up. Just a bit. Your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? They are in this place. This is a tall table. They uh, own this place. Pulled some bodies out of the office before we got here. Yeah. Gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they did. You guys all right? Are you guys yeah. all right? We're just fine, considering. How about you, Doug? We've all been through a lot. Lee, you got a second? Sure. You'd think the shock that shuts him up here would be enough to shut him up. Back on Herschel's farm. All over, but... Yeah. I panicked, you know. I'm not proud of it. It happens. It happens. I yeah. guess. But I can't stop seeing I, I really want to do a playthrough where I'm just an asshole to everyone. I killed that boy. Look, no, fuck you, Kenny. You saved him together. You didn't have a choice. No. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control... No, you totally had a choice. You could have saved Duck, put him down... Get him to run off, then help me pull Sean out. Cause Try to let it go. Figure this guy's our ride for the pretty much the game, right? Yeah, more or less. Ow. You're right there. Oh, my back's killing me. Right. Uh. Batteries! Yay! Yay! That's only one though. No. You find another one. I don't remember where it is though, so that should be fun. What about that guy? Yeah, let's talk. Let's talk to Doug. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? No. I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can yeah. head out in front of the store and be See? fine. See, it's fine. <laughs> we can go out and like go to the observation deck. Okay. Do you want to have a look around or not now? Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Sounds like a terrible so idea, but all right. Well, and it's it's down. cool. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noise. Yeah. Agreed. They're not even interested in us anymore. The military just shooting the place up, so they're all checking out that. Why wouldn't they run out and be like, military, help us, please? Because if they do that kind of stuff. Then that's just gonna attract the zombies again. No. 
I don't think he's coming back. Hmm. I feel. Yeah. I'm a little hungry, actually. I get any ideas. My flesh is mine. <laughs> Alright. We look around. The TV store. Too bad we don't have a way to come out here and watch the news. Would be nice to know what's going on elsewhere. That plan is in rough shape, and that's all I know. Uh, the hardware you store. Get in there and get weapons? Tim's tools. Too risky. Fucking you home get improvement. Is he lost to use his hardware? Oh. Oh, he knows who it is. Is a familiar face? Not his brother, is it? That's totally his brother. Oh. Yeah, that's that's one of those airwick squeezy oh. things. Get the shit out of me. Yeah. Hey, bro, what's up? <laughs> yeah. He's trapped under the telephone pole, so. Would the rest not like turn around and be like, yum? Well, we gotta think of a distraction. Yeah, there's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah. Let's go searching! We should think about searching that guy across the street. Maybe he has some, but who knows if he no, we need more concrete evidence for that. Ooh, a brick. Brick, brick, brick. <laughs> How'd you end up here, Dad? How'd you end up here? I moved here to live with my uncle. He doesn't take stuff and it just makes sense. So your uncle, he probably moved around from this place. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. Masturbating. Are you? Grew up here. I grew up here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh, so you probably knew the owners then? Yeah, I did. Good people. We gonna bow back? I guess. Let's yep. Let's go find that other battery. Mm. I don't remember where it was. Oh, there we go. That is. Uh, go to batteries. This battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. And here's another one. Should be able to get it to work now. Pretty fucking big batteries. You need D's. I think she already has some. It's still busted. Yep. It's still not working. Old and busted, yeah, new hotness. Now. Shall we try the power button mm. again? Oh, it didn't work. Could she have fucked up the batteries once more? Of course she did. Fuck it, this bitch is useless. She's good with a gun though, so she's not that useless. I guess if a woman's good with her hands, then you know, it's all good. Ha! 
Holla! Fine, get the fucking battery in the way. Yeah. She's a reporter. She doesn't need to know tech stuff. The station is okay. Oh. Yeah. That was dramatic. Let's, so. Let's do the last option. Yeah, let's actually talk to her this time. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. Yep, can't even do fucking batteries, right? My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me. And I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. Zombies just love eating us all. That guy saved you? That guy saved you? Yeah. Can you it's like everything that comes out of your mouth going to be some kind of double entendre. Whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell. You're waiting for one to do that, aren't you? Yeah, pretty much. It's kind of cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Huh? What? Uh, nothing. What? Kinda of cute in my parents' basement sort of way. No. My parents kidnapped people. <laughs> in that parents' basement kind of not my parents' basement. <laughs> She's not saying her parents kidnap <laughs> potential boyfriends <laughs> and store them in the basement <laughs> for assessment and evaluation. How'd you end up here? God. We drove out to cover the cherry oh, blossom. Fuck. Real hard hitting stuff. Yeah. Sure it was. It's the fucking Cherry Blossom okay. Festival. That radio sign off didn't sound too good. Are you okay? I'm fine. <laughs> Sorry, you didn't have to be. It's dramatic. I'm sure some people got out. Maybe they're all being rescued. Then again, maybe not. Alright. Who are we giving the last energy bar to? Ever? Carly or Duck? Oh, do we have to get to duck? Probably, well, we probably like us a lot better. Well, does it make a difference with what's his face? It makes a little difference. Like everything makes a little difference. Um. You want to be friends with Carly or with Kenny? Probably Kenny. Yeah, all right. Reluctantly. He helped her out with the radio anyway, so mm. she likes you already. It's not much, but here for the boy. Oh, thanks for Lee. the boy. He appreciates. How sweet, Lee. Can't appreciate it. Don't tell me how to feel, Dad! <laughs> Alright. Let's go into the office. Alive inside. I think we're all a little bit alive inside. I'm sure some. <laughs> There's a joke there, but I can't. I can't. I can't do it. That's a odd departure from the norm, then, really, isn't it? Ow. Uh. All right. Let's see. Up. Oh. Oh, okay. Pick it up. Pick that shit up. Ah. Uh. They're all dead. Are they actually all three of them dead? Yeah. Oh, that's really sad. His brother's the guy outside, and his parents were, like, found in here dead, and they took him out. Why would he bother ripping himself out of the photo? Because he doesn't want them all knowing about shit. Out of the place! Uh, I just... Let me have a look. I was listening to you! Like... <laughs> well, you got to learn to multitask. I know who you are. <gasps> oh. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. Yep. This is your parents' store. That's Folks why you were going to prison. Your son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Maybe Did fucking sensitive about it, bitch. You were, or that you were tied to this place? No. No. I've been sticking to first names for a reason.
You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't play it. Good, because if this lasts longer than a few mm. days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. How can I trust you? How can I trust you? You can't, I suppose. But you don't have many other Why the options. Does that come up in the video? Yeah. Is lagging? Oh, yeah. great. Like, remember back in the Harry Potter one where shit would just start lagging for mm. no reason? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Why is that luckily? Well, because. Yeah, look at you, such as butt. <laughs> oh. What's that? This is my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> This case protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you and your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, dad's just smart like that. Yep. Clementine loves her hat. Not smart enough to not get killed by zombies. I went there. Better get this door clear, huh? He's Can just found out his dad died. And you're making jokes. Yep. Right? Sure. You can't fucking hear me. Here we go. Your in the, the internet can. Maybe Lee won't judge you. How are you him. doing? How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But Don't I think it'll say. be okay. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> uh. Valentine's great. You don't have a family? What do your parents do? What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor and my dad is an engineer. Rich. Those are good jobs. Hmm. What's your job? I uh, teach history and writing and things like that. Like um, social studies? Yeah, like that. You didn't answer my question. Nope. All right, a little further. Yep. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they like hate you? I hope not. I hope not. It's just complicated, that's all. Why? It just, it just is. But you love them, right? Yeah, of course. <laughs> <Dark>. <laughs> Family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I'm not a bad guy. I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen, and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Just like Madam Pooch with those yellow eyes. No! Oh. More than a little, Clem. I'll find you a bandage. Where can we find a bandage? Maybe in the third third box, Tommy! Maybe! The fuck? <laughs> this is why I don't have any other female friends. Yeah. The, the, hard, the hard truth hits you. Yep. Yep. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something. It hurt. Yep. Put the bandage on the finger. Put the bandage. Yes, please. What? Just plus. <laughs> she said it hurt. Isn't instead of like it hurts. And just that's how I took it in my head. It's just using past tense. Not all I took in my head. Lee? I don't know. What if my parents come home and you I You do know this is going out on the internet, right? Yeah. Like people will see no, this. No one fucking watches you. Leave. Unless you tell them to. Yeah, but like 
You have more like um. I no, asked you a question. Yeah. Oh, the Find find us. I don't know. Anyway, with you now being involved, more people will surely watch it. Because you got all your fucking friends in Canberra and be like, hey, and my, everyone. And my plethora of Tumblr followers. Yeah, hey, everyone who follows Olivia and Tumblr or knows her from Canberra, come see what a filthy minded child she is. But they already know that. Even more so now. Yeah, well, fuck that. I'm gonna hold back here. Jesus. Yeah, I sure as hell don't. If, who, which one was Glenn? Glenn's the guy who went out to go scout the place. Oh, yeah! Okay, have you heard yeah. from Glenn? Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. Uh, everything seemed like came to you. Everyone out there seemed all right to you. Yeah, well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah, we'll keep an eye on him. His name is Larry. He tried to get me. Yeah. She ever ends up peeing. Yeah. I think she probably pissed herself when the zombie it's came out, right. really. It's true. Well, I'm not gonna go looking for them. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. How's your finger? How's your finger? It's okay. Thanks for fixing it. Right. We already asked for everything. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. Alright. It's good for oh, The keys are on that zombie out on the street. <sighs> but we got the photo now, so we can prove to I everyone the that the okay. that the zombie out there Lee? is with the drugstore. Yeah. You're not bad, right? Uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? No, nah, he was <laughs> he was stucking his wife. No, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. Oh. Was he bad? He was. Yep. So you gotta think about how much of the truth you're willing to tell everyone. Like, are you just gonna be like, Hey guys, I killed a guy because he slept with my wife. Do you trust me? Of course you do. Why wouldn't you? Yeah. Yep. Let's have a look around. Okay. All right. We try and go over again. I don't know. What happened? Weirdy, weirdy. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, jeez. Oh, fuck. Mouse died. No, no. No, you son of a bitch, no! Just don't get my batteries. Uh, you know where they are? Yeah, I know where they are. It's just connecting is a whole fucking ordeal. Right, I'll be back. You entertain the internet while I'm gone. So a man... AG. So a man walks into a car dealership, right? No, 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 no. And he starts talking to the guy. And he asks, is this all you got? I feel like you're holding back on me. I can't afford this stuff. And the guy says, oh, you're missing out on a good deal. Get the fuck out of my house. <laughs> now. <sighs> I don't care about the let's play anymore. You have to leave. I don't know. I thought that joke was a pretty good fit. <sighs> all right. Okay, we're good. I'm just gonna edit all that out. Are you sure? Cause I got many more. <laughs> you can't edit that out. Yeah. Uh, can I show him the thing? That guy over there has the keys. Ah, there we go. Can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. Is that your dog outside? Yeah. Just a few seconds. He, he heard a lawnmower, so of course. Aww. 
Um, there's a way to distract them. I can't remember what it is. Fucking try. I don't know. I mean, it's like you can't reach that brick. Well, why don't you fucking try? Oh well, I guess we'll just go back inside for now. Why wouldn't you just like get your foot? Through the thing. And I don't the know. Maybe the brick won't fit through the bars. I mean, obviously it Maybe will. Maybe he's but... just totally stupid. Get it? Because his name's Lee. Hey oh, good. Plot advancement. Yep. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over and send the group to come get you, alright? Awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you wanna do. Somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. So why is there a quarter over with a gun? Right Let me know as soon as you want to head out. She just found a gun. I don't know. It's a fucking zombie apocalypse. Guns increase exponentially. Uh. You ready to head out?